All right, I'm focused on my business. My business is improving the world, improving the United States, having an impact on the world, man. Live U.S. courts, uh, we're pulling up to the to the federal building, pulling up to the federal courts, uh, get this trial rolling. You know, I want to give a big shout out to, uh, to to my attorneys and everybody that showed me the love and all the heroes, man. We stand on the shoulders of giants. The bottom line, a black person's life in this country, especially black indigenous, if you descended the slaves, um, out here from the from the turf, from the soil, especially in a community like New Jersey, which such huge disparities, um, they don't think we're worth anything. So Anderson v. Whole Foods, uh, Louis Brisbo representing Amazon uh, uh, by way of uh, Whole Foods and Elite Security. And you should see the racist things that they say, right? Like they're so racist, they don't even give a fuck and they don't even think that we're intelligent enough to challenge them. So they say like the dumbest things and then they conspire with, you know, obviously like um, some of the people that make decisions are in concert with them, uh, aiding and abetting this level of criminality in which weaponizing and criminalizing, criminalizes us. And they don't expect us to be intelligent or stand up for ourselves, but we can't wait to go to trial. We can't wait to expose all the BS that they do when they come into communities, how they operate and how they try to cover up on them. So this is for every every time you see a whole who's coming to your community or a whole patient's coming to your community, just be mindful that, okay, who's giving them the money? In the case of Newark, it's Prudential, it's the EDA, it's Goldman, all of them that come in and promise l &M development, we're gonna build this, we're gonna do this and then we can't even be free in there they don't respect us and then when you go through the trial and you see their attitudes and you see what they do and how they cover it up and how they how they move it's just like they don't value us they think we're worth nothing they think we're worth nothing and then obviously if you're playing golf with somebody that's pulling the strings behind the scenes in the court you know what i mean and it's easy to do that but uh you know, again, like y'all business might be selling products, y'all business might be going uh, looking the other way. You know what I mean? But my business is perfecting my country. I stand on the shoulders of veterans and people that fought and killed to make this country what it is and give everybody opportunity. And, and our Afro-Indigenous people, our descendants of slaves, the reason why America is American. Anybody wants to come here. And although y'all don't care, y'all just want to take and use it. We do the work. I do the work. I do the work. But they're going to have to pay. You follow me? And we call them, we holding them accountable. We calling them out. We ready for any type of war, any type of trial, whatever, whatever you want. We want it. We want all this smoke. And a lot of y'all, y'all hear tough talk around other people. And black people really talk tough around other black people and all this X. Well, I would have did now, nah, bro. But y'all get scared when y'all see the judge. Pisces, when I see the judge, I'm like, what's up? What we doing? Let's go the whole way. I don't want to play. Let's go the whole way. I want all of it. 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 So, uh, Judge Chester, what's up, man? Judge Your Honor, uh, 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 all of them. I'm going to the magistrate, the federal, whoever, bro. State, local, fed, whatever. Whatever. Got to be the intelligence agencies, whoever. I don't care. You follow me is, is is give me justice is give us justice or get them death bottom line and y'all cannot make us be nothing in our communities y'all go beyond the way to break your back for these other countries putting up hundreds of billions to make sure everybody else free and expect us to be enslaved and second class in our community and if that's how you feel then it's war on you death on you right but we're gonna have our liberty we're gonna have our respect and we're gonna be treated as first class human beings impacted with billions of my 30s